so i am coming again this morning good morning good morning good morning the sun is killing me i think ah oh, look at that I got some shield i'm coming to y'all this morning as i came to y'all yesterday but i came to y'all this morning I, as I, I might make this a habit this little car gadget i have the days that i jump in the car early which is usually the days i'm taking my son to school in the morning right now i should be sleeping that's why y'all hear my voice like this because i gotta work later on today actually not tonight this afternoon i gotta work mm, i just said i'm tired i gotta be to work this afternoon until tomorrow morning and i'm tired right now and i'm up i'm tired i'm up and i won't be sleeping no time soon good morning lakeisha I was running my mouth a little bit because I ain't have no viewers. I think when I see the time at this early time, I'd be like, oh, you know what? You're driving, doing nothing. You can get on and get in the ears this morning. I actually, I don't know if y'all could, if y'all read the caption. It was actually today's scripture of the day. Um, if I paraphrased it, I would say that it says, those who believe in the Lord will be blessed those who have their confidence their full confidence in the Lord I believe it's something like that I'm not very good at paraphrasing this. that's why I just tell the truth just read it if I have to but uh again this morning is no different from yesterday's morning just coming forth to give y'all a little encouragement for the day if y'all took the scripture of the day what I got from it, what I got from it, Tashara got from it, that if we put our full belief in God, not just the belief that he exists, because the first half, to me, digests is that you believe that he exists. The second half says that you don't just believe he exists, you trust in him. I think I've said this in previous videos, the only way you can really put a trust in something or really be about what we're saying we're about is you got to get to know them how do you trust in something that you don't know how do you trust in someone that you don't know so it all always results back to getting to know god i particularly like to phrase it to say to get to know god for yourself so that's what i'm encouraging y'all this morning to do take a little time out a little second a little moment of the day to get up in hey Rosalind, to get up in his face and get to know for yourself no different than you would i'm always going to be a person that's going to make it very in front of you very plain sight so that you'll have a full understanding the same way you will get up in front of your siblings your parents get up under them your spouses your significant others the same way you will get in a face what up Derek? the same way you'll get in a face to get to know them build that relationship build that rapport where that's what it takes to really get to trust somebody like to, to be able to trust somebody it's the same thing that we got to do when it comes to god it's not enough to just know that he exists knowing that he exists is cool that's great that's you know it's part of the process but that second half where it says having full confidence in him the only way you can have full confidence excuse me full confidence i.e i would equate that to trusting would be having a relationship with God. My encouragement today is if you don't already have one, start building that relationship with God from the little things. You, know, you, you want to have a relationship with your spouse. I always bring up spouses for some reason. I always bring up relationships, intimate relationships and natural relationships, should I say, because those are the ones that we encounter on a daily basis. You know what you want within a relationship with someone whom which you care about. Rather it be your sister, your brother, your mother, your father, your cousins, whomever it is that you draw near to, your best friend. You know what it is to have a relationship with them. You know what it takes for you to trust them. You know what it takes for you to call it a healthy relationship. Put that same energy and effort into getting to know God. Start it today if you don't already have one. If you do have one, awesome. Continue it up. It's never too much time that you can spend with somebody that you love. Hazard reported ahead. She not saying that I'm a hazard. I just let y'all know that right quick. She just said somebody noted in the ways app that there's a hazard ahead. It's not me, guys. Traffic's moving, flowing, no issues. I'm paying attention to the road. 
all that. That's why y'all don't get a bunch of my eye contact. So today's video was just to come on and give y'all some encouraging words in reference or reflecting on today's scripture, which you can see in the caption. Uh, I'm going to leave y'all with that. Um, I'm always going to say, if y'all can, please check out our website, Love's Compassion Magazine, LCM is something that y'all will see me type frequently which is what that stands for loves compassion magazine www.loves l-o-v-e-s compassion c-o-m-p-a-s-s-i-o-n dot org o-r-g there is no spaces in anything everything is all as one love you guys be blessed keep it safe today keep it blessed today and if there's any way that you can be used for the kingdom of god or just helping out one of your brethren your neighbors love that neighbor as you would yourself any of your neighbors today if there's any way you can be a blessing don't hesitate because if you were in their shoes i'm pretty sure you wish somebody would swoop through sometimes that's the form that god uses the man standing right next to you the woman standing right next to you when you're heavy in your spirit those would be the ones that he'll use hello stokes good morning miss rochelle so i'm gonna be signing off because i don't want to stay on live throughout my entire ride hazard reported ahead again she's not talking about me i'm not a hazard to the streets pay attention to what she said it's a hazard reported ahead she's giving me caution i'll talk to you guys later be safe be blessed love you